Hey guys, it's Mousy, and welcome back to another episode of Mousy's World. Thanks for joining me this week. This is a pretty fun episode. I think you guys are gonna really enjoy it. Um, but yeah, so this week being added to the pumpkin patch is amazing. Jessica is not or I, I, I wasn't sure what the full name was on Instagram, but I got as much as I could uh, for this lovely photo she sent in uh, via the hashtag Mousy fans, um, which is something that is uh, going to be kind of part of my upcoming website. Uh, so yeah, thank you very much for sending it in. I love this picture so much. Welcome to the pumpkin patch. Now, thank you guys for joining me this week. I hope you guys enjoy the episode. Bye! There's a secret library in here somewhere, according to this. And... I'm a little bit- we've been all over the city, where could it possibly be? Yeah, wait a minute, run down part of the city, no one would go there, because it would be kind of like the abandoned half of the city. Well, I mean, it makes sense, like, if you're gonna put a spell on someone to, like, hide the entrance, you know, make all the people forget a part of the town and abandon it, and then hide the entrance there, so I mean, it's gotta be here somewhere, right? Do you guys see that? Oh my gosh. Okay, okay. Man, this is weird. I thought it'd be a lot bigger, you know? If you're gonna have a secret library, have a secret- oh. Um... Alright. Here we go, guys. Ah! Okay. Oh my gosh, the water's so strong! Oh my gosh. What is that up ahead? What? What? Oh my gosh. Oh my goodness. Just get up, get up, get up, get up. Okay, okay. Oh my goodness. Whoa. This is the library? This is insane. Whoa. Oh wow, look, there's a bat right there. I've never seen a bat hang up upside down like that, but whoa, this library. <laughs> this is insane. Wait, is there any way to the other floors? Like what? Oh my gosh. Okay. Okay. Let's just, let's just. Oh, there's more to the library. What's over here? There's someone down there! Oh my gosh. Okay. Whoa. There's someone here. Um. <laughs> uh. Hello! Hello? Um. <laughs> hello? Hello? Um, are you okay? Yes. Y you seem kind of trapped here by the flood. Are you sure you're okay? Well, I'm certainly not dehydrated. Uh, who are you? My name is not of importance. What do I call you? You do not need to call me anything. Okay, then why are you here? I am the librarian. I am the keeper of history and knowledge. I have recorded the history of this world for hundreds of years. Maybe you could help me? You could tell me about- No. What? Why? You have not proven yourself worthy. How do I do that? You must make it to the top of this library, then I will answer any one question you have. Oh, well, that seems simple enough. Where's the stairs in this place? <laughs> what? What's so funny? It isn't that simple. I must get to the top as well. What does that mean? Do I need to carry you or something? No, and please don't try. 
That sounds really uncomfortable. Then how do I get you to the top? You must answer the librarian's riddles. The ritual goes back hundreds of years before even I was here. So I need to answer your riddles to get you to the top. And you must find your own way up as well. Oh wow. I mean, that doesn't seem too bad. You should know that if you fail to answer a riddle correctly, you will be trapped in this library forever. Oh. Um. Hmm. And if I'll do- and if I do this, you'll answer any question I have? I will answer any one question you have. I get one question. Hmm. If I word it right, that question could give me a lot of information I need. Like, what's the deal with Red? We could find out everything about him and how to defeat him. Okay. I will take part in your librarian riddles. You choose to take part in the librarian's riddles? Yes. Then let us begin. Whoa. What? I feel weird. You have now been bound to the library. Oh, that's really intense. Are you prepared for the first riddle? Yes. Turn us on our backs and open our stomachs. You will be the wisest of men, though at the start a lummox. What am I? Okay, turn us on our backs and open our stomachs, and you will be the wisest of men? I don't know any animals like that, but what if it isn't an animal? What has a back and can open up? Wait. Wait! A book has a back and can open up? And it makes you pretty wise. I have my answer. A book. You have answered correctly. Whoa! I'm guessing I need to make my way up to the floor now. The next floor. Okay, so... Okay, so now I need to make my way up. All right. Well, I mean, in the waterfall where we came from, I mean, that's that's probably a good start. We don't have our little boat anymore, so we're just gonna have to kind of make our way over there. Okay. Well, let's see. Okay. Waterfall is probably a good start. Oh, that bat scared me. Okay, so the waterfall. Whoa, wait, what's over there? You know, this place probably had. St yeah, look! It okay, so th this must be like the stairs and stuff. Alright. Okay, it's dark and creepy. I can't breathe. I'm running out of air. Okay, come on. Let's just get into this air pocket. Whew. All right. Huh. I wonder if the stairs are this way. Okay. Um, I don't think this is where the stairs are. Whoa. Whoa. This is so cool! Look at this! They look like stars! I'll bet you this is like an observatory or something. Wow! This is amazing. This library really is cool. Although this doesn't really help us get to the next floor all that much. We'll have to enjoy the night sky some other time. Wow. 
It's so pretty. They look like little stars. Oh, okay. We need to get to the next floor. We need to stop dilly-dallying around. All right. Okay, so there's a door next to us that we can take. Let's go ahead and try that one. Get in, oh, out of the water. Whew. Okay, so. No, that's a dead end. Why would, what? Okay, this ascends. And, okay. Wait. This is the way we just came. Wait, is it? Wait. No, that's a dead end. That's to the observatory. Where am I? Yeah. Oh wait, no, we came out of those doors. Well, if we came out of those doors, when we went into those doors... Okay, we're losing health here. We need to hurry this up. Okay. No. Hopefully I won't die. Oh, I'm so hungry! Okay. We did it! <laughs> we made it to the second floor! Okay. Whew. So we came out of that door. Oh, what is it with this maze? <sighs> Alright. Look, there he is. <sighs> That's incredible. Hi! I, I've, I've made it! Are you ready for the next riddle? Yes. They hmm. come to witness the night without being called, a sailor's guide and a poet's tears. They are lost to sight each day without the hand of a thief. What are they? Hmm. They come to witness the night without being called, lost to sight in the day, Wait, a sailor's guide. Hold on, the observatory. Wait, yeah. <laughs> the observatory, stars come out at night and they disappear during the day. And sailors have used the stars as a map for centuries. Poets write about them a lot. I'm guessing they cry over them or something. Yeah, th that has to be the answer. I have my answer. The stars. You have answered correctly. <gasps> oh my gosh. <sighs> that is so intense. <sighs> Alright, so... Okay, so now I just need to make my way to the next floor. <sighs> you know, we've gotten two correct so far. That is something to be proud of. <laughs> We're totally gonna find out everything about Red now. Oh, this is gonna be great. Okay. Oh, all right, whoa. What is going on here? All right, here we go. Whoa, what's in here? It looks like a tunnel. Huh. Hello! Anything in here? <clears throat> <clears throat> Alright. Oh gosh, it's so hard getting around corners in a boat. I feel like we're just gonna like run into things. Like, look at this. 
and all this jagged ice. Oh my gosh. I feel like the boat's just gonna crash at any moment. Here we go, come on. Here we are. Wait, it was just a big loop. What? What was the point of this? It was just a big loop. Well, that wasn't very helpful. I just, I, I just got on a boat and went in a big circle. Ugh. Okay. Wait. Ugh. It's another massive circle. Can't even see anything. Okay, so we just came out that way. We came up to this floor through that way, and we originally went that way to get through. So this is the only place left to go. All right, stairs going up, that's a good sign. What is with all the snow and ice? Hey, we did it! Ha! Take that, library. Let's see. Yeah, he's there. Awesome. Okay. Whew, okay. Riddle number three. I'm ready. I've made it. Whew. It was a bit chilly in there, but I'm here. I am here. Are you prepared for the next riddle? Yes, I am prepared. Lighter than what I am made of. More of me is hidden than is seen. I am the bane of the mariner, a tooth within the sea. Speak my name. Um... A tooth in the sea? I don't think it's an animal. Although, a mariner's bane could make it an animal. A whale? Like in Moby Dick? Like that story, that book. You can't see their whole body, and it's but it's definitely not lighter than what it's made of. <sighs> come on, Mousy, come on, think. I feel like whale could be the answer, but at the same time, I don't think it is. And if I get it wrong, I I'll be trapped in here forever. I wish I could have some help with this, like, phone a friend or something, you know? Do you have an answer? Uh... 